and I haul everything I can. And just... Okay, I was, I was, I was, I was, um, I got, I got, I got, I got uh, interrupted. Like I was saying, Herbert Desmond himself is in the house. The brother is here. He showed up here at Palmdale train station of all places. Making my LA run for supplies. I do this every other weekend almost. All right, now. Let us know where you're at again, brother. Somebody was calling me on the last uh, video vlog we tried to do. Find Urban Desert on Facebook and Instagram. All right. Now, is this one of the bags you built? I'm sorry. Go ahead. You wanted to say something else, uh, Rocket? Also, we're on Wix.com to one of the bags. That's the, that's the site to order them from. All right. Now, this is somewhat of a bag that you built. <clears throat> you want to describe to people uh, what's going on with this one? This this was the very, very first bag I ever made. First bag ever came out of Urban Desert. This is it. Wow. So you guys get to see. Four years ago, and this my hauler. Wow. Wow. Rough, tough, durable. That's what you want. Wow. Now, you guys get to see a bag. First built, four years old. Here's the man. There's Jay. My first frame bag. First four frame bag. Ago. Four years ago. And now, you made me some beautiful bags too. But I take them off. I was letting them know that um, I have some travel bags that fit back here. Some real big bags. Oh, yeah. He has and a I could... saddle bag set. He has a whole set of them. Right. He has a whole set of them. Right. And we could, um, right. I was telling him how I could put the watermelons and how I could put the that's crazy. I always think about this one right here, man. This one here? This one, that's just crazy. <laughs> yeah, this is the coolest little cute bag, you know, that's for your little bag there. Yep. I asked myself, man, what the fuck? You was thinking creativity. Man, it's so good to see you, brother. How long has it been since I seen you, man? It's been at least a couple of years. Man, you know, since them two years. I've done, I went back, when I did that, that endurance race, Space Coast 100. Right, so, right, right. All right, that same bag I had, the Mongoose, I took it up from an 8 speed to a 10 speed, man. I dropped in a 22, 33, 42 front crank. In the back, I had a cassette. We were good at the 46 of the climbing hills. I took on the Salton Sea route, the 500 mile route around the Salton Sea. Gang, you hear that? Now, this guy is no joke. He has asked me to go on these bike rides with him. And, man, I'm like, yo, man, if it ain't a rest stop at the end of the road with a hotel and a, and a, sh a shower and a jacuzzi no and all hotels, in it, no I can't there. do it, man. So you tell him how rough, how rough is it, man? Remember that, that time you guys were doing um something, 100 mile no, something? That was, that was the first one I did, the first time I went off. Right. You know, I did endurance race. That was the first oh, the endurance race. talking to one when I went up to um, Black Rock Canyon. Right, There's right. Oh, no gosh, that's not right. Black Mountain Wilderness, Inception Campground, to see the Indian pentagraphs there. It's beautiful. You got to check them out. Thousands concentrated in the canyon. All yeah. right, all it's right. Black Rock Canyon, right up from um, uh, Hellendale. Right. No, not Hellendale. Hinkley. Right. You know, don't, don't drink the water. You okay. Know, take it right up into the canyon. Okay, all right. Now, tell them how we met, man. How we met a couple of years ago. He passed me on a bike and insulted me. <laughs> the, got a motor. I didn't see that, man. Man, let's see this, man. Right, yeah, right. It, man. The guy on the bike is out riding and stuff. Right. You know? And this cat, as you see, Rocket always dressed like this. Head <laughs> to toe. This what he do, y'all. I mean, man, the dude, when we ride, people literally stop and take pictures. I have a yellow tandem bike. And you have yellow, man, you look like Ronald McDonald on that bike. I ain't going to lie, dude. Look like you're working for McDonald's. <laughs> you got to be seen out there, man. Yeah, and, and that is true because. The cars, man, I'm telling you. Right. You're going to have a flashlight. Oh, I'm trying. What else do I need? Right, right. You're going to have out there with that. Right. And as you see, his colors are very vivid. Look at this man. Yeah, very vivid. <laughs> So you can see him when you see Rocket out there, slow down, and you and you bikers out there, and share the road. There you go. Peace. Yeah. Uh, it's good to see you, brother. Hey, baby, I want you to hold the camera right here. But hold it up close because we're in a bad situation. Hey, you know what, baby? Come here. Because I, yeah, I was I was just telling her, man, how 
it was dark right there. I wanted I want y'all to see my buddy Rocket and see me and Rocket together right here, man. It's been it's been two years, man. I ain't seen this cat. Is this a good shot, baby? Yeah. Now let me tell you something. I was sick. I used to have seizures. I couldn't barely talk. It took my license and everything. This was the cat that used to take me to the beach. He used to pick me up. <laughs> right. That's where you got the pictures from. Right. Yeah. I used to pay him a hundred dollars and he'll take me out. I'll buy all the food. You know, and he'll take fun. my vehicle. He used to hang out at the train station. Remember that? All night, like three o'clock. Oh, yeah, yeah, you yeah. Know, yeah. You might have to get this one because that, that thing is bad. Yeah, we don't mind. Yeah, we used to be uh, at the train station and we hang out. And then we remember that big baller we had met? Some dude came down. He was from somewhere. Some oh, baller dude living yeah. in a. They was standing in a nice hotel. Was somewhere it, was nice. It, was it Kentucky? I don't know, man, but the dude was scary. He was deep. He was deep and scary. Like they was in the drugs or something in there. He saw me and uh, Rocket down there. Yeah, he saw me and Rocket down there uh, smoking some weed and dude want to come and, you know, transact with us. But then he started telling us he was in the hair run and where he was from and um, the hotel he was at. Man, I know that was like $600 a night. But yeah, that cat used to take me um, where I need to go in my vehicle. And we also, and he also helped me um, remodel my home. We did a lot of work. I got, I got pictures of you, man, in a the whole patio, four foot man, deep. The patio, man. The patio we did the patio. That was really nice. It was like an outdoor. It right. was summer. It was hot, but right there we had like water flowing. It was like, like an oasis, man. Right, was right, tight. right. And you know what's crazy? This is the cat I was talking about, urban desert. And he rolls up. Be careful what you ask for. But until next time, I'm going to kick it with my homie right here. We're going to catch up on old times. Um, do you want to share your number in case people want? Facebook, Instagram. Put Urban Desert 1. Facebook, Instagram. So I don't tell Urban you Desert 1. Day with the numbers, like, I'm right. I got you. <laughs> until next time, I'm Arabi. And I'm Jay Bird. This is my boy right here. Uh, Rocket. Urban Desert. Peace, baby. Push that button.